Hello everyone, my name is Om San Vasong. Today I want to make a short video about Android on Backpress. I will do like please press back again to exit. So this concept is very useful. You can prevent your user from exit accidentally, you know, like usually they press back and then they just exit it. Um, so we want to prevent them and ask them to press it twice. So let's go to Android. For that you don't need any special uh, permission to do that and we don't need any uh, view here. So just go to main activity, the Java file. And what you have to do, maybe down here, you go to code menu and then override method and then you can find uh, on back press under the Android support version 4 so it just means that it happened very long time ago so this is the event and uh, it will call a super super is the app compact activity so if you have this line of code it will exit so let's test first and I use Jenny motion for my emulator okay so in your emulator just click on back it will exit but if you command it it means that this gonna stay there it won't let you exit the app okay press back again see it will not let you uh, go out from this app so now this is the point so we don't want uh, to exit you know like suddenly and you can have a toast Okay, you can say something like, please press back again to exit, and maybe a short word is okay. And it will show this message when they try to click on the back button. And now it's a trick. So, if we do like this, it means that our application will not let user exit from us, and the user will be angry. What you have to do is to call a thread to delay the action. So you can call new handler here, okay. But there are two handler. One is the Java util login, and the one that we want to use is Android.OS. So I think we have to import it manually over here. Import Android.OS handler. This is the right one. Otherwise, we will not let you use the handler, the real handler here. And we want to delay it, so we call post delay. And the action there is going to be a thread. And in Java, a thread is in the runnable class. So you call new runnable like this, and we'll click. And the second parameter is the second. So maybe three seconds. Okay, and if the three second you um, say something, okay. So now we want to say that if the button is like a quick press, you know, and then you call a boolean, just call twice here, and if it is twice, then um, you're gonna exit, okay. But around here, you're gonna hold the the button. It's like if you you press and then it will delay a little bit slower. And you call twice here and you assign it to false. And after that, um, you assign back to true. Okay. And if the button is true. If the twice is true, okay, then you want to exit from the app. So to safely exit from the app, you need this code. It's a lot of code, but it will make sure that your app will exit without any problem. Okay, so um, let's do the log here and you will understand. So let me declare it.
so I want to get a name from that so it's easy to use the code like this so over here maybe tag and say click and over here you can uh, do the you can log it twice so is, is it true and false okay but because it's a boolean so we need a string and maybe around here twice again and you will see so maybe I put it maybe over here again if you click it and you delay a little bit okay for three seconds and you click it again it won't happen now let's see the lock here so let's move it over here when I click it first see it's true but three seconds later it becomes false see so if you click it and then you click it again so it the first time you click it it's gonna turn it twice to true the reason for that is that boolean the default value is false if you don't know that maybe it's a catch here and it's better if you don't know you just clear it like this the twice is false so like the false here come in and it will check it the twice is true it's gonna exit but it's not it's just a false and then it's gonna turn it twice to true and then three seconds later it's gonna turn it to false again so if you don't press it during the three seconds and then it's gonna turn to false okay so that's it that's the end of the video if you like it please subscribe and i will see you in the next video thank you